And unless we move aggressively to transform our energy system away from fossil fuel into energy efficiency, into sustainable energy, the planet that we're going to be leaving our kids is something that we should be ashamed of. And you can't talk the talk and say, I'm concerned about climate change, and then at the same time, oh, by the way, we're going to extract huge amounts of oil or coal or gas from federal land. You can't do that. But also what we have got to do is to understand that workers in the fossil fuel industry, through no fault of their own, they're just trying to make a living, are producing a product which is endangering our planet. And we have the moral responsibility to make sure that as we transition away from fossil fuels, energy efficiency and sustainable energy, these workers are protected. I know Senator Merkley feels that strongly, and I do. Many other members of Congress do. We will soon be introducing legislation to, in a sense, make these workers protected. Uh, and that will mean educational opportunities, that will mean job training opportunities, and I would hope very much that President Obama will stand up as soon as possible and say that the Keystone Pipeline is a no-brainer, that you do not extract and transport some of the dirtiest fuel on earth. End of discussion. No to the Keystone Pipeline.